a reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Mark. King Herod heard about Jesus for his fame had become widespread and the people were saying, John the Baptist has been raised from the dead. That is why mighty powers are at work in him. Others were saying he is Elijah, still others he is a prophet like any of the prophets. But when Herod learned of it, he said, It is John whom I beheaded. He has been raised up. Herod was the one who had John arrested and bound in prison on account of Herodias, the wife of his brother Philip, whom he had married. John had said to Herod, It is not lawful for you to have your brother's wife. Herodias harbored a grudge against him and wanted to kill him but was unable to do so. Herod feared John, knowing him to be a righteous and holy man, and kept him in custody. When he heard him speak, he was very much perplexed, yet he liked to listen to him. Herodias had an opportunity one day when Herod on his birthday gave a banquet for his courtiers, his military officers, and the leading men of Galilee. His own daughter came in and performed a dance that delighted Herod and his guests. The king said to the girl, Ask of me whatever you wish, and I will grant it to you. He even swore many things to her. I will grant you whatever you ask of me, even to half of my kingdom. She went out and said to her mother, What shall I ask for? She replied, The head of John the Baptist. The girl hurried back to the king's presence and made her request. I want you to give me at once, on a platter, the head of John the Baptist. The king was deeply distressed, but because of his oaths and the guests, he did not wish to break his word to her. So he promptly dispatched an executioner with orders to bring back his head. He went off and beheaded him in the prison. He brought in the head on a platter and gave it to the girl. The girl in turn gave it to her mother. When his disciples heard about it, they came and took his body and laid it in a tomb. The Gospel of the Lord Herod feared John. John the Baptist is in the mold of the prophets of old, a fortified city, a pillar of iron, a wall of brass, against the powerful rulers. He is put to death by Herod, who recognizes him as a righteous and holy man, but succumbs to public pressure, his venal lifestyle, and self-indulgence. The Baptist would not give in weakly to pressure. He stands by his God-given task, preaching repentance and forgiveness of sin, and calling for judgment where sinfulness is recognized in public. In example, Herod's marriage to Herodias.